fine. If she hallucinated, it wasn't caused by her heart. If? The screaming, the floundering, it was an hallucination. What if it wasn't a hallucination? We covered that. I'm finished. What if it was an atypical seizure? <laughs> seizure? She saw her mother. Mother's dead. Ergo, hallucination. Anyone want to explain that? His leg hurts. Walking takes his mind off of it. Flashback. All that wind and rain from the hurricane, post-traumatic stress syndrome. Why are you so bent on her not having a hallucination? If she did have a hallucination, then the heart problem that we predicted, found, and fixed it was just a gigantic coincidence. His leg always hurts. It's getting worse. What if the heart isn't a coincidence and isn't what caused the hallucination? An arrhythmia hurts. What if her hallucination was caused by pain? What if she has a disease that translates pain into a bizarre physiological response, like a hallucination? She has an autoimmune disease. She needs a CRP, a rheumatoid factor. Or... I can prove an autoimmune disease in five minutes. She needs a PET scan. You can't test for autoimmune in I'm a pet. I'm proving that her hallucinations are a consistent response to pain, which proves that she has an autoimmune disease. How do you test someone's response to pain? Easy. Hurt them. It's not going to hurt at all. We just need to make sure you don't move. I won't. OK, give me your arm. Let's check your muscle responses. OK, turn it over. Arm upward. Everything OK? Yeah. Ow! What the hell was that? Diagnostic test. Cerebral cortex responded normally. She's not hallucinating. You know he's not your father, don't you? He's my dad. Mama told me. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hurt you. Ow! Oh. House, leave her alone. Come on, we both know it's a hustle. Are the walls closing in? No, I Spiders coming out of my nose? Let me out. House, the test is over. Dorsal lateral prefrontal cortex. Give me your hand. No. Give me your hand. Ow. Forget it. Ow. He's not the perfect mark, because he was the perfect mark. Plenty of people got there before you. He's used up, tainted, pumped dry. She's hallucinating. She's lost everything, and you're breaking fingers. A new low. Diagnostically, she needed to be hurt. I wanted to hurt her. Win-win. What I didn't consider was the threshold to trigger the hallucinations. Otherwise, I'd have done the finger bending first instead of stabbing her twice. That was cruel. If her autoimmune disease is this advanced, usual treatment's not going to help. We don't even know which autoimmune disease she has. Could be Lambert Eaton, could be Grace. Good point. Let's kill them all at once. The only way to do that is to replace her entire immune system. Good point. Let's do that. Bone marrow transplant requires an exact match. Leona has no siblings. Good point. She's all alone, poor thing. No one in the whole wide world. <laughs> 